everybody! I'm here today to tell you how to tell if you need a new car alternator. I'll be going over some signs and symptoms that will let you know that you need potentially a new car alternator. Now you should be looking for some of these signs and symptoms together. That really lets you know that this is the problem. Let's get right into the video. Number one is dimming lights, okay? Now let me tell you what the car alternator does because that will help you understand why the lights would be dimming if you need a new alternator. So the alternator is essentially what charges up the battery. So your car battery has a charge and it uses that charge to start the car and let all of the electrical run. The alternator then continuously charges the battery when the engine has been started. So as your battery drains, because the lights are on, the alternator charges the battery. But when the alternator doesn't work, okay, then the alternator can't charge the battery and therefore the battery charge will be getting lower. That is what will cause the lights to dim. Your battery charge will be getting lower and therefore your car lights will be dimming. So if you see dimming lights, dimming headlights, dimming dashboard lights, dimming interior lights in your car, on your car, then that is a huge sign. That is a telltale sign, a typical sign that you need a new alternator, okay? Number two is that the dashboard light comes on. Now in many cars there will be a dashboard light that will illuminate when it senses that your alternator is not charging the battery properly okay so what is this dashboard light sometimes it will say alt for alternator sometimes it will say gen gen for generator other times it will show an image of a battery okay it depends on the car and not all cars have even an alternator dashboard light but if you see any of those types of lights come on in your car then it usually means that there's a problem with your alternator it might not mean that you need a whole new one but it means that there is an issue that needs to be solved with the alternator so if you ever see a dashboard light coming on that relates to an alternator problem it means that you might need a new one or you might need to fix the old one okay the third sign and symptom for how to tell if you need a new alternator is the battery won't stay charged. So if you constantly need a boost. So once again, let's go over this scenario to, to understand how the, fully understand how this works. You give your car, let's say your battery dies, okay? You give your car a boost. So someone boosts your battery, okay? Then you drive your car. As you're driving your car, your battery is getting drained because your alternator can't charge it, okay? You go to start your car the next time, you need another boost. So you get a boost. You drive your car, your battery gets drained because your alternator can't charge it. And if, you, if your battery is constantly dying, even if it's dying every five days, every 10 days, it means that you, you're gonna need a new alternator soon, okay? Either your alternator is gone if your battery needs a boost every single time you start the car, or if it needs it constantly every few days, then it means your alternator is going. It's not doing a good enough job at charging the battery, okay? Uh, the fourth, sign and symptom the fourth telltale sign of needing a new alternator is a weird smell when you are driving the car now this won't happen all the time but the reason that you get this weird smell potentially when your alternator is going is simply because um, your alternator is run off of a belt so basically as your engine spins like my engine is turning right now as i'm driving that turning is driving a belt that's turning the alternator which causes the alternator to charge the battery if the belt is not connected properly or if your alternator is having some problems and you need a new one then you might get a weird smell because of the belt rubbing against the metal of the alternator in an improper fashion okay the last thing is number five the fifth sign and symptom is electrical failures so if you are constantly seeing various electrical problems then it might it could very well be your alternator so let me describe this once again if you notice for instance that your power windows are going up and down slowly okay it could be because your alternator is not charging the battery of the car and it's unable to operate the power windows in a normal fashion and this is even more true if you notice multiple things because if it's just your power windows it can be something with the power window itself. But if you notice that your power windows are experiencing problems, your locks are locking and unlocking much slower. Maybe, you know, various, um, like your power steering seems to go in and out if you have electronically assisted power steering in your car. You know, if you sense electrical failures, multiple of them, that's a huge sign that you need a new alternator. 
And that's it. That is how to tell if you need a new alternator. Those are some signs and symptoms to look out for. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great car and driving videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.